hi everyone this is hello angel Door design today i'm going to show you how to make handkerchief skirt it's very easy to make it's a step-by-step -step tutorial and i will put all my measurements on my fabric this skirt that i make is for four to five years old child and i also make a different fabric this is another fabric that i make right here and this is for five to six years old child but today i'm going to show you how you can make it with a cotton fabric please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't make a comment down below if you have any question if my tutorial is helpful thumbs up and don't forget to also turn on your notification bell button and select all option and let's get started first thing that we have to do we are going to cut our fabric i have cut my fabric i cut two pieces of fabric right here this is how it is the length of my fabric is 31.5 inch the width is also 31.5 inch if you're using centimeter 80 centimeter by length 80 centimeter by weight so this is how i cut my fabric right here remember to cut two pieces first thing that you have to do fold your fabric into two you see the way i fold it just fold it into two like this we are going to put our measurement on this fabric and then you pick your fabric again fold it all over like this you can see how I fold my fabric. So I will just put a pin here to secure these edges. I have secured my fabric with a pin. This is how it is. This is the fold hem side. And this side is also folded. While this side is the raw edges. So you can one, two, three, four. So we are putting our measurement right here. So what you're going to do, we are going to take our hip measurement. The hip that I'm working with 25 inch. 25 divided by 6.28, you have 3.9. I will just take 4 inches. If you're using centimeter, the hip measurement is 63.5 centimeter divided by 6.28, you have 10.1. You can take 10 inches or you can also take that 10.1. So what you're going to do, you place your measuring tape at the very top of your fabric. So I'll measure down 4 inches like this. And then I will come to this side and I will repeat the same process 4 inches like this. So I will just go ahead and measure it all around 4 inches. So I have put all my measurement around like this. The next thing that you have to do is just to connect the mark together. You just go ahead and connect it together like this. Before you cut it out, remember to add your seam allowance. So when you're adding your seam allowance, you're not coming down at this side. You've moved up. So I will add one centimeter seam allowance all around the waist line so this will be the waist line of the skirt that we are making i have connected together the next thing that you have to do you take your scissors just go ahead and cut it out i have cut it out this is how it is right now the next thing that you have to do you pick your second pieces of your fabric you fold it into two and then you fold it all over again just the same way you fold your first fabric and then we can now place our first fabric and use it as the pattern and cut out the waistline so go ahead and fold your fabric together i have folded my fabric together so what i'm going to do i will take the first pieces that i cut before i will just place it on top of each other and then i will just go ahead and cut out the waistline of the skirt that we are making i have cut my skirt this is how it is right now so you put that aside 
you cut a piece of fabric. So this is my piece of fabric that I'm going to cut for the waistband. So what you're going to do, for my waistband, I will take a measurement of 2.75 inch. If you're using centimeter, you can measure seven centimeter. So place your measuring tape like this. You're going to measure down 2.75 inches right here. You just go ahead and measure it all around. I'm not including this because I'm going to cut it out. That is why you see me, I'm measuring from here. Once you have measured your 2.75 inch, take your ruler, connect the mark together. And once you have connected the mark together, also go ahead and cut it out. So I will take my scissors now and then cut it out. So I have cut out my skirt, two pieces for the skirt and for the waistband. So what you're going to do, you open your skirt like this. You can see how it is right now. This is how it is. You open it like this. You just open it just like this. And then you take the second pieces, open it. And then you're going to put it on top of it. So when you're putting it on top of it, you just twist your fabric around instead of placing it like this you place you can see this side because i have a smaller table so you place it on this side and this other side the long edge you place it on this side and the long edge place it on this side you just twist them around make sure they are not the same angle you just twist them around like this so once you have done it like that, pick your skirt and this is how it will look. You can see that. This is how it will look once you pick your skirt. So I will just go ahead and put them together properly and then take a pin to secure the waistline. So I have secured it with a pin. This is how it is. You can see how the skirt is once you secure with a pin like this. So what I'm going to do, I will take it to my sewing machine and just run a straight stitch to secure the both fabric together. So go ahead and do the same. I have stitched it together. This is how it is right now. The next thing that you have to do Take your fabric that you're going to attach on the waist line of your skirt. Place it around the waist line. Once you have done that, go ahead and pin around the waist line. You're pinning your waistband around the waist line. So I, I place my fabric inside the skirt, not from outside, inside the skirt. And I'm just going to pin it around. I have pinned around the waistline. This is how it is. The next thing that I'm going to do, I will take it to my sewing machine, give it a top stitch with one centimeter seam allowance. And for the waistband, you can also see that my fabric is extra. Before I get to the end right here, I'll put the both fabric together and give it a straight stitch, cut out the excess and stitch it close. And I will stitch it close. Then once you have done stitching, trim a little bit out from the seam allowance. Then we can now fold it on top of it and top stitch all over again. I have top stitch around the waistline. This is how it is. And I also trim a little bit out from my seam allowance. 
The next thing that you have to do, take your skirt to your ironing board, fold it inside one centimeter, just go ahead and give it a good press. Once you have done that, fold it on top of the raw edges. We are going to use it to cover the raw edges. Just like this, fold it on top of these raw edges and go ahead and secure with a pin. So just go ahead and pin it around the waistline. Then we cannot take it to our sewing machine and top stitch. I have pinned around the waistline. This is how it is. So before you take it to your sewing machine and top stitch, remember to leave a gap. I place a different pin right here. I will start from here and I will stitch it and I will end here because we are going to put our elastic on this skirt. Once you have done that, take your skirt to your sewing machine and go ahead and hem your skirt around. Fold inside one centimeter, fold it again one centimeter and top stitch. So you are going to hem the fabric separately because you know that we put both uh, fabric together you hem one skirt separately and then you hem the other skirt separately I have stitched around the waistline of the skirt and I have also hemmed my skirt all around. This is how it is. And this is my open gap right here. And this is my elastic. So what you are going to do, take your child waist measurement and minus one inch or one and a half inch because you don't want the skirt to be loose. So the waist measurement that I have is 23 inch. So I measure my elastic 22 inch. Place safety pin on the elastic. So we are going to put it around this open gap all around the waistline before you get to the end make sure you use a pin to secure it right here so that your elastic don't go inside and then you have to remove it and start all over again so go ahead and place your elastic around the waistline of your skirt that you're making So I have put elastic around my, the waistline of my skirt. You can see that what you're going to do, remove your safety pin, pull it out a little bit. So you just pull them together like this. We are going to stitch it together. Take it to your sewing machine, give it a top stitch to secure the elastic in place, push it inside and close the open gap once you have done that your skirt is finally ready so go ahead and stitch your elastic in place this is the final look of my handkerchief skirt it's very beautiful and easy to make this skirt that i make is for four to five years old child this is how it finally look once you have done making your own skirt. You Please, if my tutorial is helpful, thumbs up. Make a comment down below if you have any question. If you're just stopping by, thank you so much for watching. Before you exit the video, don't forget to click that red button that said subscribe. And thank you all so much for staying with us. And you all should have a beautiful day. Bye.